願いしますこう
Other hand, each ni san si go roku shichi hachi ku ju nikyo ich ni san si go roku shichi hachi ku ju hands and then ich ni san si go roku shichi hachi ku ju san kyo to out ich ni san Shi go roku shichi hachi ku ju hen ich ni san shi go roku shichi hachi ku ju kotegaeshi to restart out ich ni san shi go roku shichi hachi ku ju and ich ni san shi go Roku, shichi, hachi, ku, ju, left hand back, right hand up, down to that left elbow, and bring that right hand across. Okay, up, right hand back, left hand up, and now go down to that right elbow, bring that left hand across. And up, you can do both hands. Then try both elbows. You can do both elbows and all the way back. And up. Okay. Right foot in front. Sorry, right foot out. Bring that left foot in. Try to keep that left knee down. Reach that right hand out towards that right foot. Now, reach the left hand towards that right foot. Now, try to bring that chest to that front knee. And up. Okay, so it's over. Now, left foot out, right foot is in. Again, try to keep that right knee down. Reach that left hand towards that left foot. Now, bring the right hand towards that left foot. Now, bring that chest down into that front knee. And up. Okay. Turn apart. Towards wide again. Both hands to the right side. Both hands to the left side. Up. And both hands to the middle. And coming up. Okay. So from here, let's go ahead and do some Kemi from the ground. So. Get on both knees. First, we're going to go ahead and do a forward roll. So as we do our forward roll, <clears throat> I want to have one side slightly going towards the front, so I'm not straight on. I've actually kind of bladed one side forward. Just happens to be on my right side. I put my hands down. Again, my right shoulder is in front. I bring that right hand all the way through, right shoulder into the mat, turn to the ground. I kick that left leg back, I tuck my chin, and then I roll from that front hand and shoulder to that back hip. Now I reverse and I do the same thing to the other side. Now this time I've got my left hand, or left side forward, I bring my hands down, bring that left hand all the way through. Tucking that chin, now my right foot kicks back, and then I roll forward from that left side to that right hip. And let's go ahead and do six more in each knee. 
San Shi Go and Rook. Okay. So that's our forward roll or Mayu Kemi. Uh, <clears throat> for backward roll, Ushiru Kemi. I'm going to start seated all the way down here. I'm seated on my right butt cheek. So my left knee is up. I'm not seated down like this. I'm actually up on one uh, butt cheek, having my left knee up. I tuck my chin. Now this time, I'm going to take everything towards my left side as I do. And I go over. Notice I started with that butt cheek goes down to my lead shoulder, or to the shoulder that was up. If I do it again, now on my left butt cheek, right knee is up. Now I bring everything over to my right. Same thing, okay? So again, let's go for six, and each knee, sun, she, go, and work. Okay. <clears throat> Next exercise, Minuchi Kyondo. Swinging up exercise or uh, head strike exercise or uh, yeah, Menuchi head strike uno exercise. So as I'm here, I'm gonna protect my head, bring my hands above my head, and bring them right back down in front of my hips, not behind, so up and down. Try to keep my feet planted as I go up and down. So, each knee, sun, she, go, Ro, Shichi, Hachi, Ku, Ju. Okay, now with the right side or Miki Hami, same thing, and each knee, sun, she, go, Ro, Shichi, Hachi, Ku, Ju. Okay, now if we pivot, or kaiten, we go up, down, pivot around, up, down, pivot. Okay? <clears throat> so, each, ni, san, shi, go, ro, shichi, hachi, ku, ju. Okay, now something we haven't done in probably a couple of weeks, hapo uno, eight direction exercise in a basics class. So we're going to use that minuchi iki uno, that swinging up exercise, to go into eight directions. We already have all the basic pieces we need. As we're here, we slide forward, up, down, and that's one. Two, we kaiten, up, down. Three, we look to our left. Swing, up, down. Four, we pivot or kaiten, up, down. Five, we take a step with our left foot. 45, up, down. Six, we kaiten, up, down. Seven, we take another step with our left foot. Up, down. Eight, we kaiten, up, down. And we should end up back where we started. This time we're starting left or hidari hami, so <clears throat> my left side is going to be uh, the side that I move on. Okay? So as we're here, so one, pivot, two, step, three, pivot, four, step, five, pivot, six, step, seven, pivot, eight, and then back to the front. Okay? One more time. So each knee, sun, she, go, 
And back to the middle. Okay. So we've done sliding, shiriashi. Okay. We've done pivoting, kaiten, tenkan. I hear left. I pivot. I step back. Still left foot forward. Pivot. Stepping back. Okay. Again, uh, try to do better than I do and try to keep that <clears throat> idea of that. Uh, You've got a little pole or whatever going through the top of your head. You want to keep your shoulders over your hips the whole time. So just try to do better than I'm doing, okay? And each knee, sun, she, go, rook. Okay. Right or Mickey how knee, same thing. And each. Ni, san, shi, go, rook. Okay. Stepping and turning. Iri ni tenkan. Here. Left or higari hami. I step with my right foot. Pivot. Draw the foot back. Now my right foot is facing that way. Or I'm right or miki hami facing the other way. If I do it again, I step. Pivot. Draw back, now I'm back where I started. And it me ten down, each knee, sun, she, go, roll. Okay. Front foot tension. So remember, front foot tension. Something's coming from my front to my front side. I acknowledge it, so I want to. Turn my hips to it, and then bring my foot back, and draw my other foot, changing hamni. Again, I should be at 45, not 90, or as best you can. And each knee, sun, she, go. Rook. Okay. Now right to me on this thing. Each knee. Sense. She. Go. Rook. Okay, back to the left or hit that me now. Rear foot tension. My back foot moved because of, instead of something coming to this side, it comes to this side. So again, I acknowledge it, move my back foot, front foot follows. Now this time, I preserve my hummus. So we're here, and each <clears throat> knee, sun, she, go. Rook. Okay. Last one, right or Miki Hami? Each. Knee. Sense. She. Go. Rook. Okay. So let's go ahead and we're going to start. So let me grab. Our newest member. I know I shouldn't be picking on a white belt, but this is our newest member. We still haven't come up with a name for for our newest member yet. So if you got one, make sure you share it with us on Facebook or where have you. So tonight, let's go ahead and look at. So last week we explored Kihon Osaiwaza. So that was Ikyo. Nikyo and Sankyo, okay, the basic wrist positions. Now let's also go ahead and look at some of the basic throws. So we'll first start off with Iri Menage. So if I hear my partner's grabbed onto me, one way I can start it is I can just cut up, cut behind the elbow, come in here, kite and pivot. So we're looking the same way. 
I then raise up. I want his shoulders off his hips. And then the way I like to throw Iggy Menage is I'll step back behind my partner and throw it through there. So he hopefully doesn't face plant. Okay? So, this, again, this is just one of the many variants of Iggy Menage. They're here, they grab Katapitori, I raise in, coming up underneath the elbow, slide in, kaiten, as I kaiten, I'm gonna pivot and look the way my partner was looking, and then from here, I raise up, pivoting back. As I pivot back, then I step through, and throw Iri Minage. Again, I want to try to keep my shoulders over my hips. I try not to try, I don't always do it, where I overextend. So, one more time, we're here. They grab Katate Tori. So, stand right there, thank you. As they're here, they stand, I slide in, cutting up underneath the elbow, raise, pivot, kite then. As I kite then, head is on that shoulder. I pivot back, and I pivot back, my hands stay in front of me. And then from here, I just step through and throw any managa. Don't kick your partner. Don't kick your partner. Okay, so let's go ahead and explore this variant of Edi Manage. Now, can you do it uh, off of something besides Katage Tori? Yes. We're just trying to get to where we come in and kaiten, raise, and then step through. Okay, so here I am. Left or hit Dari Hami. As I'm here, I slide, cutting my hand underneath. I grab their head, bring it to my shoulders, I kite that. Then I raise up, pivot back, then step through to throw. All right? So, now right or mid behind me, same thing, they grab on. I slide, cutting up underneath the elbow, kite then pivot. I take that head, bring it to my shoulder. From here, I raise that hand up. Pivot back, and then step through to throw. Okay, facing back from the camera, here, they grab on. I slide in, cutting up underneath, head as I kite bend to my shoulder. I raise that right hand up, pivot my hips back, step through to throw. Okay, right or knee behind me. Grabbing on, from here I slide, cutting up underneath, kite then pivot, head comes to the shoulder. Left hand raises up, I pivot my hips back. Now I step through to throw. Okay, two more. Here, left, I hit that hip knee. They grab, I slide as I cut, kite then, bring that head to the shoulder. Raising up, kite them back, step through, to throw, Idi Menage. Right or Miki Hamni, here, they grab on, I slide in, pivot, head to the shoulder. Raise up, pivot back, step through, to throw. Okay, so, in terms of the Ukemi, as I'm here, my partner should be coming up to the side, bringing my head into the shoulder. From there, it raises up, and then as they step through, I can just do a nice, easy back fall. So, a couple of the key points for the Ukemi here, it's as I'm here, and they come up and, and they redirect that, my head should be going off, those are my, these are my hips, off my hips, and to the side. It raises up. Again, my shoulders and my head are off my hips as they step through. If my partner comes through and just pushes my head forward, it's not breaking my balance. And they step back, I'm still balanced here. They need to bring me off my base, off my hips. 
from there, and then up. Okay. So, if my partner's left or hidari hami, I'm grabbing right or miki hami, grabbing on, hitate tori. So from here, they slide in, they do that kite then, they bring that head over to the side. They raise it up, shoulders should be off the hips, and then they step through to throw. So, if my partner is right or miki hami, I'm grabbing left or head that way. So from here, they come in next to me, they slide, they do that tight bend, bringing my head to their shoulder. Should be off my hips. They raise up, again, it should be off my hips. Now from here, they step through and throw Iri Menayi. Okay? If my partner's left, they hit that on me. I'm grabbing right or midi. So from here, they slide next to me, they come in, Bringing my head to them. Do they do that kite then? Now they raise it up, shoulders stay off those hips, and then they step through to the throw. Okay. Last one for the penny. So, partner's right or meeting on me, left or hidari. So as I'm here, I grab on, they slide next to me, kite then, bringing my head to their shoulder. Head is off the hips. They raise it up, again, shoulders and head off the hips. Now they step through, throwing, eating menage, doing some sort of appropriate backfall. So, that's the first one. I'm just gonna come in here, pivot, pivot back and throw. Now, let's add in a 10 count. So let me get my partner once again. Hello, partner. Please, join me. Some modesty. <laughs> so, Hello, partner again. So, again, we've gone back in. They're grabbing me. I'm going to start the same way, but now I'm just going to do a tan con as I bring them around. Head still stays on the shoulder. I raise off, and then I step through to throw. Okay? Hopefully, they do better with coming than that and they don't land on their arms. That would be bad in okay? So, as we're here, they're grabbing on, I slide in, bring it around, tan cup. I raise back up, step through, and throw Edie Menage. Okay? So, he's a little disheveled at this moment. Oh, modesty, please. Thank you. Please, it's profess already. So, as we're here, I slide in. Going to get deep enough behind, okay? So that when I tan kind of pushing them forward, pushing them into my, oh, into my shoulder, I raise up. As I raise up, Stepping back behind and throwing Iri Menage. Okay? So, thank you, partner, for helping me once again. You like that, don't you? Okay. So, as we're here, left or head down and me, we start the same way. We're just going to slide in. Get next to our partner. Now this time we ten count. As we ten count, hand goes to that shoulder, raises up, steps through, throwing Iri Menage. Okay, right from Miki Hanmi. Again, same thing. It starts with that initial slide. I get next to my partner. I bring that head to my shoulder as I do the ten count, raising up and then stepping through to throw Iri Menage. Here, left or hidari hami, they grabbed on, I slide, hand con, hand to the shoulder, step through, yidim and I. Okay, right or miki hami, same thing, I slide, 
Hand time. Head to the shoulder, step through, and the rope. Okay, last two. Here. Left hand down the knee. I slide in front of Hand come. Hand on the shoulder. Step through. Throwing. Evi manage. Now, right or midi ham knee. Here. Take my one. I slide. Hand come. Hand to the shoulder. Step through. Evi manage. Okay. So now the Achilles changes a little bit because now I need to go around. So as I'm grabbing, my partner is going to again slide next to me. Now, this time as they do that 10 con, I've got to go around the circle. Raise up and throw. Without having a physical body there, it's going to be very tempting just to slide back. Okay? But you got to think, you've got a body right here, right next to you. So you've got to turn around that point as it comes up. Again, for Idimenage, same things apply. Making sure that your head is off your hips for the throw. Uh, if, when we get back to training with regular people again, if they go to throw you and you're pretty much right here, your shoulders are stacked over your hips, you're going to be very hard to throw. They need to break that balance at some point so where your hips are not, uh, sorry, your shoulders and heads, uh, head and hips are not all in alignment. So, left or head down me, I'm grabbing right or knee. So from here I grab, they slide next to me, they do a ten con, so I bring my foot around, they have that head on the shoulder, so my shoulders are off my hips, they've raised up, and they step through, and throw me, eating and out, okay? okay. Partner's right or making hum knee, left or cadet. So as I grab on, they slide next to me, they bring my head as they do the 10 kind, so I come around, hands off the hips, they raise that hand up, stepping through and throwing up. Eating manage, okay? Partner's left or cadet hum knee, grabbing right or midi. So from here, I grab on, they come in, they do 10 pounds, come around, head comes up, and throwing, eating the numbers. Okay? So finally, right, my partner's right or knee me. I'm left or hidari, I grab on, partner comes next to me, they do 10 pounds, I come around the corner, they raise up, shoulder, your head around the hips, and they step through. Eat even out. Okay, so that's kind of the two basic uh, eat even out that, we'll, that we cover. Uh, let's get on to another technique. Oh no, my partner has grabbed me once again. So now we're going to do a variant of a kokyuho or a kokyunage. So as my partner has grabbed on, grabbed on to me, I slide next to them, hide them. <laughs> and then they fall all over. Hey, how are you doing? So, okay, get your feet. There we go. So, as they grab, I come in and kite them. Shoulder to shoulder, raise up, back down to throat, okay? As I'm here, I'm going to slide next to my partner, get shoulder to shoulder. As I'm shoulder to shoulder, I'm going to raise up, pivot, kite them back, and throw. Oh, oh, that just did not look natural. <laughs> you put something to not connect it right. <laughs> okay, so one more time as we're here. We slide in, get shoulder to shoulder with our partner. We raise, oh, hey, how you doing? We raise up, pivot, oh, come back here. His foot's bang. Huh? His right foot is not in his shoe. 
Yes, right, I'll, I'll fix this here. Okay. Here, raise up, pivot back, and throw it. Okay? So, <laughs> thank you, Mr. Corner. So the next set will be going over the arm, and we're just going to work again on that kite and footwork. Okay? So, as we're here, left or hidari hami, we're going to slide into our partner, putting our right hand on the wrist, pivoting. As we pivot, we pivot everything in our center, raise our left hand up, pivot back to throw. Okay? Okay. Right or midi hami, same thing, we grab on, we slide, we kite them, keeping everything in front of us. Raise that right hand up, kite them back to throw. Okay? Left or hit that hami, we're here. Slide next to our partner, kite them, raise up, kite them back to throw. Right or midi hami, here. Slide next to our partner, kite then, raise up, kite then, back to throw. Okay? Left, we're going to me. So, two more. Slide next to our partner, kite then, raise up, kite then, back to throw. Last one. Right, or Mickey Hami. Back down, slide, kite then, raise. Tight then back to throw. Okay, and as you can imagine, the ukemi is going to be pretty similar to the first one. Uh, it's going to be similar but different because as I'm here, now the hand is going to be coming in front of me. So they can't move my head to get me off balance. So what they're going to do is they're going to move my arm to move my shoulders off my hips, bringing my hand, my head, where their arm is, so it raises up as they kite them back to throw, okay? So, partners left or hidari hamni, I'm right or midi. From here, they slide next to me. As they kite them, they're gonna move that hand into their center, bringing my shoulders off my hips. Head is also off my shoulders. Now they raise up. As they kite them back to throw, you do appropriate ushiru ukemi. Okay. Partner is right or me, how me? Left or hidari. So from here, my partner slides next to me and kite them, bringing the, my hand in front of them, shoulders are off my hips, head is off my, is off, off, my, off my hips. They raise up, as they raise up, they kite them back to throw. Partner is left or hidari, how me? I'm right or midi. So from here, as I hold on, my partner slides next to me, Kite them. As they do that, shoulder comes off my hips. Head, head goes with it. They raise up and then they kite them back to take appropriate count. Okay, last one. Partner's right or midi hami. Left or hidari holding on. So from here, partner slides next to me, does kite them, bringing my hand out of my center. From here, they raise up, as they raise up, they kite them back, and throw. Okay, so let's also now go ahead and do this with a uh, tenkan. So let me see if my partner will cooperate with me for a tenkan. So again, I start with that initial slide in as I come in here, and actually I'm going to have to grab my partner back here. I draw my foot back, I tenkan. I raise up, and then Kite back as he does something that's <laughs> okay. So here again, slide next to our partner, bringing it over the top. I draw that foot back. Just hold on to my partner. Back down again, or right then, raise up and throw. Here, here comes the national partner. Tenkan, kite in, raise up, and we do the dip. <laughs> we do the dip. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Out. 
Python and 10 can take on an Python to throw. Dip optional, depending on how comfortable you feel with your partner. Maybe they want to be dipped, maybe they don't. <laughs> it also depends if your dance card is full. So let's go ahead and now do 10 con Python footwork, okay? So as we're here, left and down and have me. I slide next to my partner, hang on. I come back, I 10 can, kaiten, raise up, kaiten back to throw. Okay? So, right or maybe behind me as I'm here, they grab on. I slide next to my partner, and go look up. I 10 can, kaiten, raise up, back to throw. Okay, face the camera, left and down behind me. Here, I slide it to my partner, can go to the top, I can kind of kaiten, raise up, kaiten back to throw. <clears throat> right from me behind me, slide it to my partner, hand at the top, ten can, kaiten, raise up, throw. Okay, last two. Left or down behind me, slide it to my partner. Ten pound, right then, raise up, back to throw. Right or midi on me, there are. Slide next to my partner. Ten pound, right then, raise up, and throw. Okay. <laughs> so, for you can me on this one, as I'm here grabbing, my partner's gonna come next to me, and from here, they're going to 10 come, really bringing that hand over. As they kite in, that's going to bring that arm to the bottom completely over, raise up, and then back to throw. Okay? So again, as I'm here, they slide next to me. As they do that 10 con, that's going to really make sure that brings my body off the center or off my base. And as they do that second, as they do that kind of thing, they should shoot me around that corner. So, partner's left with that and me. I'm right or me, on me, holding on. It's not the point. So my partner comes in, they slide next to me. Now they do that 10 times, they should go way out. As they do that kind of thing, they should be coming around. They're going to raise up. Again, shoulder, drop the hips. They kite that back and... Take a partner to shoot okay. <clears throat> partner is right or me behind me. I'm left or get down. So here, grab on. So partner slides next to me. They do the 10 count. Now I do that high then and come all the way around. Shoulders are off the hips. They raise up, they kite then back, and throw. Okay. Left and then hum me, some right and me hum me. As I grab on, as I'm here, my partner slides next to me. They do the 10 counts, so my hands coming out here. They do the kite then, bringing me all the way around. They raise up, shoulders are off the hips. Kite then, back and throw. <clears throat> Last one for the family, partner is right and me hum me. Left or head daddy. So as I'm here, my partner slides next to me. They do the 10 con. Now they do that kite then, bringing it all the way around. They raise up, kite then back, and throw it. <coughs> okay. So that's two of our basic throws. That's one that we do a lot at Imanage. Second was a kokyuho or kokyunage. Third, let's go ahead and do tension out of heaven and earth throw. So from here, I split one hand up, one hand down. Okay? And then from here, I then step through to throw. That All right. really well. Okay? So, as we're here, big points are 
big things about Tenshinage is you have to have one up and one down. Usually, whatever hand's in front, that's your down hand. Whatever hand's behind, that's your up hand. So as I'm here, as I slide in and go into this position, I'm here, and then I just step through to throw. Okay? Okay, one more time. We'll talk about the, the ways to begin in a second, but first, uh, first and foremost, the basic thing on tenjinage, heaven and earth, or upper and lower, is whatever hand's in front, that one goes down, whichever one is behind goes up. So as I'm here, I split them. One down, one up. And I want this hand to make sure it's off the hips to help break the balance. Then as I step through, I step all the way through to throw my partner. Okay? So, pardon me? Okay, nice. So very quickly, um, <clears throat> a lot of the ways that will show the starting of tension on you, the hands are here in front of you, and we'll have you split them as you go off the side. So we don't want you to split them and then go forward because, well, your partner's arms are right there in front of you. So as you split them, you want to go off the line. And then the way I like to do is I like to go back through the line to throw. My personal preference is as I'm here, they've got me, I slide next to my partner, do a little kite thing, and then open my hands way up, and then step through. Again, it gets to the same point, which is I'm off the line, hands are apart, it's in front of me, and I'm going through the line, okay? So, choose whichever um, opening works best for you. So, Muroke Tori, two hands, grabbing two hands. So, as we're here, we start off, we split the hands, we step through the throat, tension out it. Okay, right arm, Miki Hami, we're here. Okay, Ryoke Tori, two hands, grabbing two hands. As they're there, we move in, and we split the arms. Okay, one hand down, one hand up. Now we step through to throw. Again, when you throw, try to keep those shoulders over those hips. All right, so as we're here, we slide in, or I like to slide in next to my partner, do this little kite thing, and then split the hands. One hand down, one hand up, and then step through to throw. <coughs> Right or maybe hand knee, same thing. We come in, we split the grip, or split the hand, stepping through the throat. Okay, two more. Here, again, I like to get next to my partner, and I come back over, splitting my hands, and then I step back through them to throw. Last one, here. Ryoka Tori, two hands, grabbing two hands. I get into my partner, I split the grip, then I step through to throw. Okay, so for the ukemi portion, I'm holding on here. Okay, so as I'm holding on here, my partner should be doing to have my front hand go really low and off to the side. This other hand should come straight up. Okay? So I should be completely off balance where shoulders are off those hips. And then as they move through, I can take some good, some variant of a good uh, back fall. So if your partner stays right in front of you and just does this, well, you're completely stable. Okay? So they've got to do something where they move those shoulders off those hips. Okay? So if my partner starts here left or Hidari Hamni, I am right or Miki Hami holding on. Rio, Rio Tori, two hands grabbing two hands. From here, my right hand goes down, my left hand comes up. Shoulders are off my hips. Then my partner steps through and take appropriate Shiru McKinnon. So, partner's right or Miki Hami. 
On the left or hit that, you're holding on. Two hands, holding on to two hands. From here, my left hand goes down, right hand comes up. Shoulders should be off the hips. And then my partner steps through and throws tension out of it. Okay. Partner's here, left, or hit that hami. I'm holding on right or midi hami from here. That right hand goes down, left hand is going up, same time. Shoulders should be off the hips. And then they step through and throw tension out. Okay, last one. Partner's right or midi hami. Left or hidari, holding on. From here, they slide next to me. Left hand down, right hand up, shoulders are off the hips. And then they step through and throw Okay. And as the thing would go, then we can also then just do a ten count to do the Uda variant. So as we're here, we ten count, split the hands, and step through. Let's see if my partner can help me with that. This would be just a little more interesting. I, I didn't try this one. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't try this with them earlier. So, <laughs> hello partner, how are you doing? Chest bone. My neck's broke. Huh? Terrible, my neck's broke. <laughs> so as I'm here, I slide next to my partner, and then I tan time, split the arm, and then step through the throat, okay? So, <clears throat> Oop, hey, hey. I don't know that one. So as we're here, we're going to slide next to our partner, and then tan con to bring him around. Then same thing as last time, we split the hands through without thrusting the elbow, and then we step through to throw. Okay, one last one. That actually works out a little bit. So. Maybe you can try this one on Thursday with Taisei. So as we're here, slide next to our partner, and con, split the arms, and then stepping through to throw. You know, you get some of those crash test dummy circles to put on the sides and the back of his head. Do you want it with the shock impact? Oh, we, so we know where the sauce ball would be on a normal person. <laughs> okay, so here we are. Left, or hit that We're grabbing on. Rio de Tori, so we slide next to our partner. And from here, we ten con. As we ten con, we break the hands out, and then step through to throw. Right, or midi hami, same thing. We slide next to our partner, tan count. Spread the arms apart, step through to throw. Okay, left with the dying hamia, they go grab on. Slide next to our partner, tan count. Spread the arms apart, step through to throw. Okay. <clears throat> right or midi hamia, here we are. Slide next to our partner, hand con, split the hand, step through to throw. Okay, last two. Left or hidari hamni, they go grab on. Slide next to our partner to begin with. Ten con. Split the hands, step through to throw. Okay, last one. Right or midi hamni, grab on. Slide next to our partner, hand count. Split the hands, step through to throw. Okay, so on this one for the ukemi, as we're here, our hands are going to go this way, okay? Hopefully our partner's moving next to us and not right in front of us. If they move right in front of us, they have other issues. So they should be coming here, and then as it comes around, the hands split apart and then they step through the throat, okay? So, here, 
Hands are gonna, should move to the side. As they move to the side, I'm in tan con. My feet should be coming around. From here, those hands should split. And then, stepping through the throat. So, partner, left or hit that on me. On right or mihi on me, my partner slides next to me. They do that tan con from here. The hands split apart, and then they step through and throw. Okay, partner's right or Mickey Hamni. Left or Hidati. So from here, partner slides next to me. They do the tan con. I come around, hands split apart, and then they step through and throw. Hang chin out here. Okay, partner is left or hidati hami. I am right or midi. As I hold on, partner slides next to me. They do ten high, I bring it around, my hands split apart. They step through and Okay, last one. Right or midi hami. Left or hidati. So from here. My partner slides next to me. They do the ten pound. I come around and split apart. And they step through and throw. Okay. So let me see how far I have left. See if I can do this or not. Two minutes. Okay, a little less than a minute than two minutes. So let's try to do uh, Kokudosa. We're very into Kokudosa. Well, I have no idea if that would work. Um, <laughs> His knees can't bend, right? Not, not anymore. Not, not the way I've got it okay. right now. So, uh, do a standing kokudosa. Yeah. So in kokudosa, two hands, grabbing two hands. I actually want to be on the inside. I want to raise the elbows up, out, and then pivot. Okay? So as they have a hold of me, I want to raise up, bring their elbows up, pivot, and throw. So, we do seated or regular kokidosa. As we're here, I'm going to do this facing the, the camera, so hopefully it all makes sense. I present my hands neutral from here. I bring the hands up, take a kind of out. I look to one direction, everything goes that way, and then hands come down, trying to keep shoulders and hips together. Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So once more. I felt try one. So once more. We're here. Regular kokidosa. They hold on. Neutral position. I raise up. Kokyu. I look to one direction. Bring everything that way. And. Have it calm down. All right. Domo arigatou gozaimashita. Okay, thank you very much for those of you uh, in person as well as those of you uh, online this evening. Um, so, uh, tomorrow's Zoom class, we'll actually look over a lot of koshi nage because our newest partner really loves to take koshi as well as some of the otoshi or big drops. Okay, see you then.